That's so rude. <laughs> it's just gonna be a thing. The synchronized coffee drinking is just gonna be a thing for the whole game, huh? Can't stop, won't stop. Is there anyone you'd like us to reach out to, Mr. Wake? You've been gone a long time. No. No. If they'd be in danger, it'll come for me. Okay, let's talk about something else. Robert Nightingale. Do you know him? You were both here in 2010. Is he in the first game? The Dark Presence got him back then. Oh, yeah, it did. That's the last time I saw him. 13 years. Tell us about the pages. You had what looks like a title page with you. Return. Is this the name of the story on these pages? The writer's name has been scratched out pretty violently, but your name can still be made out underneath. <laughs> scratched out. Yeah, scratch. This is... Did you write these pages, Mr. Wake? I'm trying to remember. It's, it's, it's a crazy jumble, like, a, like a nightmare. It doesn't, it doesn't make sense. poster in the background. Alan, what do you remember? Don't go- no, Alan, don't go into the puddle. Uh, whenever it, like, cuts between loading screens, it does the- like, desyncs the audio from the subtitles a little bit. Got a new thing. We get to play as Mr. Wake. So I am a talk show tonight. Waking up in places with no memory of how I got there. Oh, the old gods of Asgard. I didn't need another mugshot in the fucking tabloids. Had I already done the show? Was that a recording? Let's watch and find out. Oh. He looks very familiar. Not, not because he's Alan Wake, obviously, I mean for a different reason, but... <laughs> this is it gets so Ooh. surreal. <laughs> oh man. It is so good to see so you. So very surreal. Uh, uh, this must be an exciting time for you. Tell me, does it ever get old? Sorry, does what get old? Publishing a new book. Are you okay there, my friend? You look like you've been so I'm being a little quiet here, just for a few too many years. <laughs> There's just a lot. I'm trying to process here. <laughs> you know, I've waited so long to get my hands on the sequel to Departure. You left us on quite Oh, a right. We've all been dying to know what it's not a lake, it's an ocean really means. Right, Departure was the book from the well, first one. And Return is the book now book. from this one. Initiation. It's the shelves tomorrow. What? That's exactly what every reader will be asking. This book is Initiation. So cerebral. I mean, how would you describe it? A, an auto fictional thought experiment? Like House of a, a, Falling a Leaves? Story, a postmodern detective story? Wait. 
This isn't right. I, I haven't written anything. He's so humble. Okay, you got me. Good prank, very funny. But yeah, I sad to say, I, I, I've not written this. I, I'd remember if I'd written a book, right? Or maybe it was written by your evil double. <laughs> oh, oh, sir, you think? <laughs> well played, man. You that think? You think you might have nailed it? Roll here, pretending the world of the book overlaps our own. Very meta indeed. You see, Initiation tells the story of a fictional writer named Alan Wake, who is trapped in a nightmare, desperately yes, trying totally to find the manuscript of the manuscript. Definitely not what's happening. Totally not real. The book is set in New York, but it might not be New York at all. Probably isn't. He's is tormented by his dark doppelganger. Mr. Scratch. Guided by visions of a fictional detective. I would assume. That's right. Alex Casey is in this book as well. <sighs> I guess we'll just keep doing this the whole show. The joke's on me. But isn't that what you sign up for with auto fiction? No, but seriously, I found the the structure of the reality you build in the book fascinating. It reminded me of the Matrix. I mean, the writer is physically in his writer's room, trapped there, and he projects himself out to this dark dream of New York through the story he is writing. Like astral projection. Did I get that right? Yeah, that's exactly right. Go on. I should be taking notes here. This is great stuff. Notes to that other Alan Wake in that room writing this as we speak? Are we all in your story, Alan? <laughs> wow. No, I, I, I wish you every success with your new book, Alan. I hope it's as successful as your best-selling Alex Casey series. Initiation hits the shelves tomorrow. This is just this a lot to process. We'll eagerly awaiting the culmination of this hero's journey trilogy of yours. Oof. A book called Return, perhaps. Oh, see, there it is. <laughs> We're getting Initiation, yeah. and then you for one of the Saga's thing is Return. Okay. My entire career, Alex. <laughs> All this talk of meta now. What if it does? What are you gonna do then? This is all a figment of your imagination. None of it's real. It's never been real. God, that was a cool transition, though. Alan? Hello? Alan, are you okay? Oh, it's so dark. I'm losing it. <laughs> you're right telling. Here. Alan, you're telling I me. I need to get home to Alice. What's that on the floor? Oh, yeah, we haven't talked about your wife at all. You've been missing for 13 years. Do you think she knows? Is there anything over here? No, you can't see anything. I can't see for shit. What happened to the old gods of Asgard? Uh, where am I going? What am I doing? Do I have any sort of inclination as to where I should be going? Uh, I guess we'll go back this way, because this was like the only other way I could see to progress over here. What the hell was that interview? Some kind of joke? Initiation? I never wrote a book called Initiation. Nope. This felt like a bad dream. It's always a bad I'm dream. Like a good horror story. Between with Mr. Door. Can I open this? Nope, that's locked. We're trapped. What's in here? Old Gods of Asgard. That name sounded familiar. 665 neighbor of the beast I'm gonna remember that I'm gonna remember that number that might come in handy I was a mess I had never heard of this talk show or mr. door before none of it felt right was I losing my mind <laughs> no you can't do this to me game no please oh this is too much metal wise the Alan Wake and Casper Darling are both, both voiced by the same guy. I do like that they're now all just tying everything in, though, with Control and with, with Alan Wake. I knew that there was a connection, but it's like they're starting off very strong with it. Uh, 665. See? Came in handy sooner than I thought. Very light puzzle. There was something here. A 
broken transmission I couldn't quite make out. Oh. What was that? It's the room. A message? It's Tommy was so's to room. There's nothing of value in that transmission. You don't need to figure it out, Alan. It's fine. Just throw sporks at the screen. What? Oh. Just a wet. Just a wet floor sign. I thought it was moving for a second. Is there anything over here? Can I open this? Let me out! Let me out! Get. Uh, um. There was something in the studio with me. No? I had to get out. No, don't don't say that. Don't say that, Alan. I don't want I don't want you to say that there's something here that we can't deal with. Uh-oh. Let me out. Let me out. It got me. This is the ritual to lead you on. To lead me on, you say. To take on me. Take me on. Waking up from the nightmare, I felt like a drowning man gasping for air. This place felt familiar. A ghost of a memory surfaced, about riding here for countless days. I mean, as far as writing rooms go, it's pretty spacious. It's a little too spacious, though, if I'm being, if I'm being honest. There's a lot of empty... I had been writing. Initiation. You must write to escape. They do say books are a portrait to an... Is this my version of the case board? A plot board for mapping out a story. On the index cards, the nightmare that just happened to me. A summary of the story so far. Oh, this On is... other notes as well. Literally. Warnings. I had written them. This is literally our, our version of the mind meant. place, the case board. The name Scratch filled me with dread. I could trust these words. Are you I sure about that? Are you sure about that, Alan? To escape. This is our plot. Let me zoom in. What have we got? Part one, late night. Read me, beware scratch. Alice. Waking up to a nightmare. At the talk show I thought was in New York, but none of it felt right. Enamor beyond our world. The writer's room is my safe haven. My writing affected what, this, what was outside. The story was called Initiation, but the story I wrote, I projected myself out to look for a way to escape. I had to write more. Dark place trapped. You must write to escape. Well, cool. I like, I really like the framing of this. This is so cool. I couldn't leave. What do you mean I can't leave? This wasn't the way out. Oh, right. Writing is the way out. We got to write. What are we going to write, though? Tell me. Tell me, Alan. What are we writing? We're staring at a blank page. It's the most terrifying thing to a writer. Too many possibilities. I didn't remember much, but I knew my thoughts and ideas could manifest as reality in this dark place. I'd use my writing to project myself out of this room like a deep sea diver to go deeper and explore the depths of this prison for a way out. This room was my boat. Writing was my lifeline. I would start again at the talk show. It never stops. Oh, we're back. We're Alex back to the. Casey is here Wait. Right. Right, and oh, the actor. Oh. We gotta. We gotta write to find our way out of here. 
I will write my way out. Write anything down far as I can see. Welcome back to the show. Welcome back, everybody. So, Alan, as the uh, creator of the character, how do you feel about this? Sorry, what? I know it can be an awkward question with the man sitting right next to you, but I mean, how do you feel about him in the role? Oh Casey shit, it's the guy. It's Alex Casey. Uh, <laughs> he looks exactly like I always imagined Casey to be. He really does. It's uncanny. Thank you. That means so much to me. I'm a huge fan of your books. So, uh, what's the problem, Alan? Because on more than one occasion, you voiced your reservations about the adaptations. Uh, it's not that. They're their own thing. They've gone with choices that are different from mine. I, I, I feel protective about my stories, and these adaptations... I, I don't know. I, I guess I just wish I could have been more involved in making them. Well... Mm. In that case, you That's won't have seen this either. True for basically every we have a clip from the adaptation. New film, Murder Case Case. Should we roll it, or do you want to say something first, Sam? Nah, just roll it. Very good. So he's like the actual face model for Alex Casey, the detective this in the game. City was an old scar that refused to heal. The rain made it fester. It needed the sun, but there was only the night. I was tired. Insomnia covered me like a plastic film. I was watching the world through a rain slick window, my own reflection haunting the view. I was trying to track down the missing writer. My only clue was a table lamp shaped like an angel. The only thing to shed light on this sordid mystery. <laughs> okay. Great murder case, Casey. Great job, Sam. Very exciting and very meta. I'm looking forward to seeing more. Wait, stop mugging stop. for the camera. What was that about a writer? About a lamp? You've given birth to more information for yourself, Alan. We have more now. We have a lamp. And in that lamp, a genie who will grant us three wishes, one of which is to get out of here. Let's go. We have a clear point of progress. It's just down this, down here. Let us out. We're gonna find it this time. Let me in. Oh, now it's just, oh, there it is, it's back. Six, six, five. Six, six, five. now it's blinking. Five, six, five. See, now it's different. I'm glad I waited because that to me is an indication of something has changed. That's not the only, okay, that's the only thing that's changed. Uh, cool. So this time it's not gonna be 665, this time it's gonna be 565. We figured that out real fast. Feel good, I feel good about that one. All right. Can we, can we actually get out of here now? Do we think, do you think it will be so kind as to let us leave? I don't want to get attacked again. Hello? Oh, this time it's on, okay, this time it's open. Hello? Ati? I hear somebody humming and the only person I know who hums in Remedy Games is Ati the janitor. Where are you? Who is who is doing the humming? Hello? Come out of the toilets with your hands up and your pants down. Nope. Okay. Nothing in here. Nothing at all. Why did I come in here? Hello? Ooh, a map. It's Mr. Doris dressing room. 
Oh, we just walked right past the janitor's room. Oh, okay. I was confused for a second. Ah, <gasps> There you are, Tom. Ati? Oh, not so much evil that not a bit of good as well. What are you doing not here? One without the other. <laughs> good to see what? you. What are you doing in this game? Hey, I, I can't seem to find my way out of here. Oh my god, everything's <laughs> colliding. Of course, Tom. It's like a the younger Auntie. He looks a little maker. younger. I was gonna get something from the basement for you, but you can get it yourself now. Uh, the more cooks, the worse the soup. <laughs> I mean, that is that's not the saying, but you know what? You got you got it. What do you want me to get from the basement? And my name's Alan, not Tom. Yeah, yeah, but I got a bag of man's a man, but the man with the tool makes two, Tom. Egani. <laughs> And a man with a tool can build his own exit. It's in a shoebox in the basement where you left it. Oh, that's <laughs> actually very helpful. Thank Save you. As in the Lord's purse, here's the key. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Ati. Um, have we met before? I know I have. I know I've Are met you. Are you trapped in the dark place, too? You remember Ati, the janitor. You can't be lost if you don't worry about where you are headed. So that, don't that worry. That sounds like Ati. The sun will shine even into a heap of twigs. Just remember to turn on the lights. It won't take long when you get to work. Oh, you're such a calming presence here, Ati. I've been trying to find a way to escape the dark place. Any suggestions? He who mouths about his troubles is the prisoner of his troubles. It's not easy to get out. But don't you worry, Tom. The home is still there where the heart is. Oh, that one was actually almost right. I often think about it when I mop the floor and look into the puddle. What, it, what deep wisdom Water are you about to drop the on me? Water is memory of the world. Water finds its way. The janitor was a bit out there. But still a friendly face. That's what everybody says I about had to Auntie. Trust he's, the basement would get me out of here. He's just he's just good. He's just a good egg, Auntie is. Uh okay. So we need to get down into the basement. Which should be this way. Just gonna open that. Now, so the basement is Oh, uh, we could actually push open this door over here we fully open this back to ourselves now oh this is my room this was the green room there's nothing in here though uh cool all right you can now I said there's a basement shortcut in Auntie's room, but I assume that's gonna mean that we can't open it just yet. That'll be a thing that we can open later. So, into, stop that. Stop, stop making ominous noises, you know? I know this is supposed to be a survival horror game, but I need you to stop being creepy for just a second, please. It's too much. Uh, we have the basement map already. Was there anything? No, it's it's not showing up as a interactable object. What? You telling me there's light over there? Is that what you're blink? Ooh, Deerfest float. Is it everybody? Is everybody? I know Deerfest is still a bit away, but you know, it's never too early to get excited about Deerfest. Deerfest is forever. It lives in our hearts. What is, what is Was this? Was this what the janitor had left for me? Oh, it's the angel lamp. It's broken. The lamp felt significant. A tool for bringing It's light disconnected. To the Somebody cut the cord. This is supposed to be my... Ooh, I've got my, my little bag. I felt a magnetic pull between the lamp and the light overhead. Whoa! Uh. The light jumped into my lamp. The whole room changed. 
Uh, like something in a dream. Open the uh, way forward. The lamp was humming. The bulb glowed. Wait, I want to put it back. The light now. Was there anything else over here before we do anything? No? Okay. Gotta steal the lamp again. Or steal the light. This is horrifying. Um, hello? But it's like... Ugh. Where do we go? I felt another there surge from the lamp. The glow in the lamp went out, shifting the light in this the room. This is where... The light carved out something new from the darkness. It did. It did do that. Anything interesting back here? No. There is a door, though. Where's the... Where does the door go? Can I steal the light back? I can. Ooh, this is actually a really cool kind of like puzzle mechanic. Not that it's like super unique, but it's it's definitely very, very cool. So we have our lamp now. Assuming that was the only thing we needed out of the basement. We come in. We came in from here, right? This is where we came in from. What does this do? Was did this do anything? Though, if we need to do that again later, I'm sure we can. Trying to see if there's anything interesting. <laughs> really dark room the dark place wants to drown me i'm losing myself i have to fight it i have to remember oh the lord the light switch i lost it but i have the lamp now the lamp the switch was cut from this place is a nightmare not real and yet more real than anything the danger and the horror are real it feeds off my mind twisting whatever it takes into psychotic reality i'm trapped here I write to escape. I've tried this many times, written countless stories, forgotten how many. I keep failing, but I must keep trying. I use the story to dive deeper. Every word I write is a step forward on this spiral of the darkness. I dive to the body to find the answer, the, the map, the key, the compass. But that's combined to form a door leading out. But how do you open a door that's not a door? At the bottom of an ocean, that's not an ocean, and a lake. That's not like. Oh, okay. All right, that's cool. That's very cool. What was it called? What was the name of the his book that he wrote that he didn't write that he didn't remember writing that he did write? Oh, that's a lighting effect. Okay, that's interesting. Ah, initiation was the name of the thing. Alrighty then. So, my inventory is getting full. I don't have anything in my inventory. Excuse me. Fussy with me. Ooh. Well, we don't have anything in our inventory, so that doesn't mean anything to us. Uh, um. This isn't, this isn't where I left. I wasn't. The phone was ringing. I got Somehow out. I knew the call was for me. Um. Oh no. Where am I? I mean, I lo it looks like New York. Um. Hello. Excuse me. Can I help you? How did you get this number? It's it's a public payphone. I have always wondered how that hello? happens. Hello, like you just call a public payphone. Yes. Do you know who I am? No. Who is this? We'll get to that later. There are spies all over. Shadows. Who are you? A sense of deja vu washed over me. Who are you? Had I had this conversation before? Helen, listen to me carefully. 
Caldera Street Station, the subway. You need to go there. Why does everybody I'll keep saying Caldera later. Street Station? Sure Where, what is it? Do I know you? I, I know you from somewhere. You just forgotten again. We're in this together. Don't worry. I got it now. I'm We're exclusively worrying on. I, I'm losing you. Exclusively worrying Hello? about this. Hello? This is my number one concern right now. You know what? Don't even put it back. Leave it off. Leave it off the receiver. I want to. I'd like to see them call me after we've un not actually hung up on them. Are those water droplets on that subway pass. That was actually really. That was nice. To the subway we go, Alan. Casey. Um. Hello? The man had said Caldera Street Station. I had to go there. All right, well, we got another map now. So Caldera Street Plaza is here. So we're not that far. Though I am interested. I don't have any weapon. Every time I, like, come out of it into the thing, I'm super confused. Uh, I, God. Part of me really wants to explore. But I have no weapon I have nothing to defend myself with I don't have any batteries for a flashlight that I don't have all right well I don't think I'm gonna be able to go that way there is a there's a fuzzy line what happens if I try oh it does let me go out there to an extent but not a, not very far The game designer's trying to tell me that, hey, that's not where you're supposed to be going. Ooh. A box. What do you mean there's nothing in it? Can I... Sir? Ma'am? Uh... They're not here anymore. They must have had an appointment. Where am I? You know what? Let's Fuck. just. Oh, okay, don't mind me. Just passing through. Shadows stirred like there was someone there. I don't like but that. But there was no one. I wanted to keep it that way. Good. Good. Me too, Alan. We're in agreement. We're in agreement. We don't want any of that. Ooh, there's a TV. This is some, this is some, uh, surreal, some real TV here. Surreality TV, not just reality. We, uh, we haven't been having a good time in here, have we, Alan? We have not been having a good time here in the dark place. I could spend so long, but for, for my benefit and for yours. The Caldera Street station sign was there, but the entrance was missing. Oh. Uh, I had to make it appear. Well, that's. Maybe I could use the lamp to reveal the station entrance. Uh, well, we would need light first, wouldn't we? Can I, can I, is there somewhere I could get light from? The lamp was dead in my hand. I needed to find a light for it. There's light over here. I could... I could steal this lamp. No. No, it can't steal that. That's locked. Uh, oh wait, over there. That is an active light. All the way back down the road, so... Excuse me as I just... Just run down the road here. There was a light at the end of the alley ahead. Night neighborhood illumination, you say? You lost? No, I'm not lost. I know exactly where I'm going. There's light at the end of this tunnel, and I'm gonna reach it. Stop. Stop being here, and stop appearing randomly. I don't like it. 
I don't like it one bit. Is this the way it was on the page? What the hell? Alex Casey, is that you? Oh, hey. We met at Door's show. Alan Wake, the writer. I'm Alex Casey, looking into a murder. Come on, what? What is this? <sighs> yeah, what is it's this? A piece of evidence, a manuscript of a novel. You wouldn't know anything about it? A manuscript? What manuscript? I need to see it. Rumor had it the manuscript contained the details of the murders. Oh god, the that sounds familiar. Following the story to commit their gruesome acts. Was Wake their leader? Had he written it? I didn't do it. How far would he go to create a perfect Why are you accusing art? me? I'm stuck or here. Would he be the next victim. No, please. That's a terrible thing to say in a horror game. That's the last thing you say before you die. Well, it was nice knowing him. It was nice knowing him while it lasted. Oh, Alan, are we really gonna go towards the Casey. horrible light yes. and sound and, and death of Alex Casey? I remember dying in this alley in a dream I had. It was just gonna keep killing me here, loop by loop. Uh oh. You're not gonna get what you want. What do you mean? You no, know, you know shit. I do know. You don't really want I know everything. You're gonna get what's coming to you. What is it? What's coming? Give me your gun. You're dead. You don't need it anymore. Ooh, a flashlight. Ah, oh, I feel so much better now that I have a flashlight and gun. This was an echo of the books I had written for Thank years. Oh God. Dude, Thank what happened to your arm? Like is it just bent behind your back? Okay, detected. it's just bent behind your back. Why does this game keep tricking me into thinking people have been dismembered. Give me that. I had a light now. Oh, that's I needed to get back to the subway station entrance. Ooh, wait a second. There's a secret down here. There's a secret and I will find it. Is there a What's inside the room? Uh. Shit. With the alley in darkness now, restless shadows block my way. Restless shadows, you say? That's fine. There's arrows that are pointing our way out of here. And that's. Wait, is this a loop? We just came through here. We. Does that, does that do anything for you? Huh? Oh, his body's gone. That's not good. Um, huh. Can I burn them away? No, it would seem, oh, oh yeah, they're gone. Okay. No, see, I don't, I don't think so. I think not, actually. I think you will leave me alone and you will allow me to leave. Hey. Hey, stay away. Who are you? I don't know who you are, but you're, you're dead now. They didn't. And I don't have any. They were trying to stop no me. compunctions about that. The gun and flashlight, I could find that. Oh. Please, just let me go. I'm running low on batteries. I can use the light to open the subway entrance now. 
I just want to make it to the station. I've got a train to catch. Well, first things first, there's another one down here that I want to I want to do this one. This one needs to show me what it's got first. I found a thing. I wonder what's up here. Is it a secret? Is there a tasty little reward? I would like a tasty little reward. Do you have one for me? Perhaps. Are you going to reward my explore exploratory urges? Alan Wake 2? Like a good little survival horror game? When I go off the beaten path, you give me a good thing? Uh, don't talk to me. You're a stranger. Don't talk to me. Can I get in this room? What's down here? Um, wait, didn't I just come through here? Oh, good, a break room. Is there anything? Are there goodies? Give me goodies, please. Ah, oh, thank you. Batteries. I'm just going to refill on battery juice really quick, and we're going to set down a save. Good, 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 good. We're good. Things are good. Because now I can come over here. Hey. Who is making that noise and why? I wish you would stop, whoever you are. Hello. Oh. Hey, Alan. Oh. Stuck up on me. It's the sheriff. Sorry. Have we met? Memory problems again, huh? Yeah, we've met. What was his name? Tim Breaker. Tim Breaker, right. We've shared notes. Hey, I've made some progress on the map, if you want to take a look. I still haven't found my mystery man, though. Who are you looking for? You're making a map. What kind of Trying map? To. It's hard to map a dream, though. I keep ending up in unexpected places. I find interesting things like those strange markings that react to the light. But never the one thing that I'm looking huh. for. Feel free to check the map out. So he's gotten oh, trapped. Stockpiling supplies while I poke around. If you find a stash, take anything you need. I appreciate the help. He got trapped here as well. Who's this okay. mystery man? Oh, it wouldn't be much of a mystery if I knew. All I have is a name. So I feel like Warland Door. Warland talk show host. Oh, the talk no. show host. Yeah. No, that doesn't sound like him. Well, his name is Mr. Door. The guy has many disguises, but a talk show host. I'll keep looking. All right, Breaker. Um, so wait, are all like the the people that have been going missing, like taken into the dark place? They've been showing up here. Ooh, thank you. I'll take some pills. Let's pop some pills because we are damaged. So we have a new. Oh, that's okay. That's really interesting. Okay, so now we've got like these like little mystery areas that uh, are like little little spots for us to investigate. And this is one of them. Very good. <laughs> well, that's my crazy wall. I'm just trying to make sense. Remember, of I was at the morgue. Okay. I was about to give I'll the audience to the FBI. Day. Door transported me here to this dream reality. Why? Okay, so this is, oh, this is contiguous. So this is Breaker right after he got transported here. And now we know that he got transported here. Why motive? Why me? Missing time, no memory until now. Have I always ended up here? Will I forget when I get out? Abducted. Polyhedrons. Okay, interesting. All right. Uh, well, you don't have anything else for me, right, Breaker? Okay. So this is good. This is good information. See you, around, Alan. See you Breaker. This is some good information that we have found here. Uh, and now... Are you approaching me? Why are you approaching me? Wait. There was something hidden here. Might would reveal it. The 
words of the lamb. Meeting. Had I written this? Words of power can be used to make wake stronger. You can assign them in the writer's room. I have words of fix. I have one word of lamp. Main attraction restores 50 health for each second when using flashlight boost or hostile shadows. 10% chance to stun enemies on flashlight boost. Okay, but we're going to need multiple words to be able to do this. Yeah. So we want to be on the lookout for those. Oh, it's a box. Okay. Ooh. I will take all of that. Thank you. Uh, can I climb this ladder? Oh, I can. But I want to see what's in this room first. Oh, man. Wait, where am I? Uh, this feels like a bigger area to explore than up the ladder, so we're gonna do that first. Alan, you're gonna throw your shoulder out if you just keep, like, blasting into them like that. Like, I'm not your fucking doctor or anything like that, but that's... You should take better care of yourself. We don't know what's gonna be happening. I had written books about Alex Casey for years. Something lingered here. A line from a half-forgotten story. Uh, where's the echo? Align the echo by approaching it from a specific angle. We can't possibly look at it from the right angle from this side, so leave me alone. Uh, what am I looking at over here? Oh, this is the other side of that, um... I'm pretty sure. Yeah, this is the other side of that one alleyway. Oop, more bullet. Unlock this. Very good. I'll take that. I'll take that. Love unlocking shortcuts back to the main area. Let's see. Anything hiding back there? Don't freak me out like that. How dare you? You think you can scare me by putting an imprint of a man on a wall? Think again. Think a second time. What do you... Oh. <laughs> oh, that's funny. There's nothing in it. You tricked me. I can't believe these arrows tricked me. How dare you? Pointing me towards an empty cooler. Oh. Never mind, I was not tricked. I found words. Words are good. I'll take words. All right. So those, those, um, circular things, those are where words are. All right. Good to know. Good to know. Lost. No, you can't prove that. I know exactly where I am. Do I know what I'm doing? No. I'm lost in the metaphorical sense. But not all who wander are lost. I'm simply searching for the good stuff. Oh, can I steal this? Fuck me. Oh, that's terrifying. I got, I got combo breakered. I got combo breakered and I didn't appreciate it.
Oh, I'm alive again. Hey, you want to try that again? You want to go? You want to fight me, son? We're going to do this. times Oh player do your job Are you dead yet? Can you please die? Oh my god. The nerve of these people. The un... The absolute gall. I'm just a writer. I'm just a little writer. What do you want from me? Uh, wait, can I open this? No? I see another word. Word of gun. We got a word of war earlier. So, increase the damage dealt by the last bullet. No, increase the double. No. Maybe the flare gun. Wait, do I need to go pick up the words of war again? Did I... Don't tell me I missed the word of war. Now I gotta go back and get it again. Ooh. Yeah, I'll take that. I'll take next to the box that didn't have anything in it. Maybe it'll have something in it this time. Nope. Nope. Turns out. All right, words of war. Uh, let's see. We don't have any of these other things yet, so let's just go ahead and Oh, I see. So this isn't um this isn't one of those things where you have to like put all three points in to unlock it. You just need to like every time you put a pip in, it just increases that thing's efficacy. So that's nice. Can't really complain about that. I mean, I could, but like, what, what would the point be? <laughs> where would the box be? Oh, there it is. Is that a flash grenade? What? I'm just gonna pop some pills really quick. Uh, so it says there's an echo here as well. Am I looking at it? Is the echo in the room with us right now? God, these police sirens are killing me. I have to look at it from like the right angle though. What is the right angle? Do you think? What is the right angle do you think? You stay over there, I'm not dealing with you. You, you can do your shit. I'm so tired of all of you. Go away. You just hang out in the darkness. Or something. There we go. Alright, our station has become available now. We're gonna have a fun little detour really quick. So, don't mind me. Yeah? Do you have something to say to me? 
I don't, I don't think you do. I can see that, but like, how do I? I can see our little dot over there. No. Wait, did I go up here before? I don't think I did. Ooh, more heal. Thank you. More heal is always appreciated. Oh, wait, never mind. Some sins, the evidence of the crimes committed, could never be erased. Not by the rain, or any amount of therapy from Dr. Jack Daniels. Oh, oh to remain <laughs> bruises under my Jack skin. Jack Daniels. Like He's not a good licensed therapist, you know. It's cheap soul. though, comparatively. Scar tissue on my heart. That the rain. The scar tissue on your liver is definitely falling. from all the Jack Daniels. And I never stopped. Cherosis. You don't want that. You don't want that. Don't talk to me. Don't touch me. Don't even look at me. None of you get the privilege. None of you get the privilege to touch me. I'm a famous writer. Fuck off. Alright, these guys are nothing. They're posers. They're wannabes. They're hacks. There we are. The city was a monster, poised to tear into you the second you let your guard down. Hard boiled and hung over. You, you had it tamed. Hard Casey. You knew what the hell you were doing. Your last mistake. So that's why it was telling me over monster. here. Because I literally walked past this earlier. Oh no. That you knew what the hell you were doing. Your last mistake. Unless you got lucky. I gotta say to get lucky. The way they've incorporated this into the world and like the sort of audio visual tricks they're using for this are really, really cool. Was gone. Was never there at all. You'd gotten turned around somewhere along the way. Freeze, Casey! The city was coming to finish you off. Oh, he's and there gone. Was nowhere left to run. He was just a shadow. An echo, if you will. Give, please. Got a word of action. What does that mean? What does that get us? Increases damage dealt to enemies in close proximity. Alan makes 20% harder for enemies to detect. Decreases damage received from darkness projectiles by 25%. That seems pretty good. Ooh. So the next one will give us 20% increased damage. Cool, cool, cool. All right, cool. Yeah, here it is. What do we get this time? Word of fix. Uh, oh, come on now. Uh, and what does fix do for us? Maximum health increase, max health restored in safe havens by 30%, restores 50% of max health when a new word of power is discovered. That's fun, but I think just a blanket increase in maximum health is also pretty good. Don't talk to me. I'm not interested in anything that you have to say. You're just figments of my imagination. And I would like you to stop talking. Uh, there, there it is. Come on, come on. Ooh, another word of fix you say. What do we get? What do we get this time? Uh, sure, we'll hit that one. Things are looking good, though the six bullet revolver is stifling. It makes sense because this is like the weapon he had in the f don't no, shut up. You don't know me like that. 
Well, I guess that's my last name, so that makes sense. But just calling someone by their last name without any kind of honorific or like suffix in front of it feels really rude. You're being really rude right now. And I really don't appreciate it. It's hard enough being a writer to be disrespected like this much. I can't, I can't even. I'm writing the call out post as we speak. 